all right guys so you're welcome back to our tutorial so today's video i want to show you how to design a thank you page for your product so already before now i've explained to you what a thank you page is and i said a thank you page is a one page website that you can use to thank people who have uh purchased products from your website right so let's dive into my shit right now let me show you how to get it done straight up so all right guys so here is uh, my uh wordpress dashboard where i'm going to be uh, designing my thank you page right so how am i going to be doing that what i need to do is to just come down to this place called uh, pages then click on add new page so once i come down to pages i'll click on add new pages right so i'll click on add new once i click on add new the next thing i ought to do is uh um uh, name this particular section right here you see where we have our title i'm going to come down here and click on uh, let's say typ page right that's thank you page right thank you page Right, this is thank you page for digital product. Right, just name it any name you want to name it. Right, so let me just name it like this. And then the next thing to do is to just come down here, click on publish. Like, right? look at it here, click on publish. Click on publish. We're going to wait for it to load up. Once it load up, then we're going to be using our Thrive architect to view this particular stuff you are seeing right here. So, all I need to do is to just come down here and I click on launch tribe architect and once i click on launch tribe architect the next thing i need to do is to select my template and once i select my template then i will start writing my information about thanking my customers on how to uh oh sorry about thanking my customers for patronizing my business right so let's quickly wait for my system to load up right now right and then let me show you how to get it done All right, so once uh, your page loads up this way, all you need to do is to click on pre-built landing page. Now, we also have the normal page. The normal page, which is the uh, building from scratch. But I don't want to build from scratch. All I need to do is to come down here and use uh, the pre-built landing page. So once I click on pre-built landing page, then I'm going to see all types of landing page, or all, all kinds of landing page that I'm going to be using to design my thank you page, right? But now, I don't want to use... Um, uh, any of this particular page you are seeing here, I could just come down to legacy landing page and look for anyone that suits me, right? While trying to design my website. All right, so I'm going to click on this particular one right here. You see this particular one you are seeing right here now? I'm going to be using this as my thank you page, this particular one you see right here. So I'm going to click on this one. Then once I click on that one, so we can see here, we have here to be thank you page. We have here to, we have here to be sales page, right? This is the full sheet of that sales page. Then we have the thank you page. Then we have the journal, the journalist price page, right? But I'm not going to be touching anything here. I'm going to be looking at uh, this particular one that we have, we have here as what well, the thank you page. I'm going to come down here and I click on this guy here. So once I click on it, I'm just going to click on apply template, right? So once I click on apply template, the next thing is going to happen that is going to happen is the template loading up on my dashboard, right? So let me give you about uh, uh, 30 seconds ready to load up right there, right? So now our page is loading up. It's going to give us the um, uh, the templates of this particular stuff that we chose just now. So let's see how this is done. All right. So as you can see, uh, the particular page that I chose for me to design my thank you page did not show up. So what am I going to do now? So I'm just going to choose another section to design that uh, sales page. Right, so I'm going to come down here, preview landing page, come as a legacy uh, landing page, scroll down, okay, I click on this one, then let me click here, since this particular one did not show, so I'm going to click on this one, then click on apply template, so let's see what we have there, let's see what we have there, all right, so the thank you page did not load up, but now I'm going to convert this very one that loads that load up, which is the sales page now, I'm going to convert it to a thank you page, so I just want you to listen to me, Re, uh, 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 watch this video to the very end on how I show you how to do this landing page, right? Good, all right. So now I don't want this very section here. You see this particular stuff you see right here. So once you see this stuff display, like it means you can edit. You can see all this content box here, you can see, right? It means you can edit. So first of all, I can remove this one now. I'll delete it. I'll delete this full section for this particular guy. Then delete this very full section here. I don't want it, right? So I'm going to come here and delete the full section like this. Oh, that's a mistake for me. Okay, Control Z is to actually to undo. 
right? So I'm just going to come here. Yeah, let me cancel this one off. Yeah, this is what I want to use on my thank you page. All right. So now all I need to do is to just come down here and delete every other thing you see right here, right? If I don't need them. Now, now let me quickly show you something. Okay. So I'm going to say thank you for thank you for patronizing us. Right. Thank you for patronizing us. Is that the correct spelling for patronizing? Well, if that's not the correct spelling, then uh, I think uh, something needs to be done. Okay. So it's not correct. So good. Patronizing. Thank you for patronizing us. So if it's a, 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 a physical product, I cannot say okay. Okay. So if it's a physical product, I cannot say thank you for patronizing us, comma. One of our, I cannot say, one of our custom, okay, one of our agents, a agent, we contact you to confirm your order. Right? So you can see that right now. Thank you for patronizing us. One of our agents will contact you to confirm your order. Right, you can see that now. Full stop. Kindly make sure. Right, you can see that. Kindly make sure. You are available. Kindly make sure you are available to confirm your order. Okay, full stop. So I cannot come down there and put in full stop, right? Then I can come here and say, if you have any further, okay? If you have any further information, Kindly reach out to us via the WhatsApp. Okay, via the WhatsApp button, right? Below. Right? You get it now. Via the WhatsApp button below. Right? So this is WhatsApp button. I cannot come down here. Click on the body of this particular button right here. You can see this first one where you have master color. If I click here, I cannot turn it to green. I cannot turn it to green. Why well, I'm doing it is because I want uh, people to see that okay, this is a WhatsApp button, right? Good. Click on apply. So once I click on apply, I'll just come here now. Look at click on this very text you are seeing here, and then I'll now write um chat on WhatsApp. Boom. That's all. Then I'm gonna do uh once I do chat on WhatsApp, then uh, uh, the next thing I need to do is uh, to probably just um, uh, click on the body of this guy again, and then put in my targeted URL. That's my target URL. That's where I want them to actually come to, right? So for us, uh, for us to be able to do that, just come down here now and click on what link, right? What does link? We have what dot link. Just come down here. Let's say you want to put in your website, your, 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 your WhatsApp phone number. Just come here and click on create uh create a link and put it 090 20 43 59 24 and then just come and say hi i just placed an order an order for your okay those are order for the physical physical product right let's say okay let's say for the um Arthritis products, right? Let's say you are selling digital product, right? A physical product, arthritis products, right? Good. So automatically, once you click on generate uh, my WhatsApp link now, it's going to show you a link, right? I come here, I click on copy, and I cannot go back to where I have my uh, my thank you page that I'm designing. Just come down here, right? You can see here, just double click on it, and then paste it here, then click on save work. So when you click on save work, then um, Everything you see here, I can now remove everything you see here. So let me quickly remove everything you see here. 
right now, right? I'm gonna move everything you see here. Look at it. I'm moving everything you see here right now, right? Move everything you see here. Move everything until it remains that only in that page. You can see it is very, 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 very simple. Very, very, very simple. Now let me save it now and preview the uh, sales page for you so you see how it is. So now it has been saved. You can see all changes saved. Then I come up, I'm going to come here and click on preview. Now, once I click on preview, you're going to see how my page look out. Boom! You can see very, very beautiful page. So now, if they want to talk to me, all they need to do is just come down here and click on tab on WhatsApp. Automatically, they're going to send me a message on WhatsApp. So you can see this is how to literally design a thank you page for your product, be it digital product or physical product. So this is how to design a thank you page. So once again, this is Miracle Sajile again. And if this is your first time of coming across my YouTube channel, kindly hit the like button and click on the notification bell so that whenever I drop a new video, you'll be the first person to see. All right, so thank you. See you on the other side of sources.